Not many people know about this astronomy term before, the black moon. In a way, the black moon is the opposite of the blue moon. Instead of two full moons in a calendar month, we have two new moons. But that's not the only scenario that describes a black moon. There are three more. The black moon also happens on the third new moon of a season that has four, and it's also used to describe a month without either a new or a full moon. The black moon that appears on September 30th will be the second new moon of the month. It will not be visible, obviously, but what will be visible because of that are thousands of stars that appear brighter under a clear night sky. So mark September 30th on your calendar, check your weather, and enjoy the night sky under the black moon. Well, the black moon is actually a normal cycle. So, what's with all these people on the internet saying the end is near? It seems there are certain people, in certain faiths, that are always crying that the world is ending, and we must repent. In fact, they have been screaming this same, wrong message, for centuries. Of course, there is no evidence of it anywhere, except, perhaps, in their heads. Most pagans, being attuned to nature, are well aware of black moons, and no, it most certainly, does not foretell the end of the world. Of course, pagans tend to worship nature, and understand the movement of celestial objects. And to think, those who scream, the world is ending, think our beliefs are strange, and wrong. Makes one chuckle, doesn't it? <laughs>